Hey, how's it going, everybody? My name is Michelle Obama, and welcome back to the channel. Hopefully, you guys are having a wonderful day today, dude, because it looks like some brand new information in regards to some GTA 6 has been coming out in the last couple of days, and I thought I'd gather all the information that I got and share with you guys in today's video to keep you up to date on what's going on with the progress of that game and exactly the news that you guys should know about. Anyway, guys, before we continue on with today's video, I'm basically going to be going ahead and hosting a PlayStation and Xbox card giveaway where I'm going to be giving away some shark cards to my subscribers and viewers who do watch my videos in honors of the brand new DLC update that we're going to go ahead and be getting very very soon. So I know a lot of you guys don't have money to buy all those brand new DLC cards so I thought I'd take it into myself to support you guys with some cash. So if you guys want to enter make sure that you guys first leave a blue thumbs up on this video. Second make sure that you guys are subscribed to the channel of course and thirdly make sure that you guys are following me on Twitter because that is the place where I'm going to be going ahead and announcing the winners for the brand new giveaway. I'm basically going to be doing this all throughout the week when the brand new DLC update hits all of us on Tuesday. So make sure you guys don't miss out on that if you guys are looking for some easy cash. Alright man, so it looks like in the last couple of days, like I said, some brand new information in regards to some GTA 6 has been gathering from the from the grave actually. And I've been searching and searching and searching and it looks like the information just keeps piling on and on and on. So if you guys don't know, GTA 6 is going to be a while before we actually do get it. Now, the release date on the game is scheduled to be out for 2018 now that doesn't mean that rockstar is not gonna go ahead and uh you know leak out a couple of things or you know some other gaming websites are actually finding out some stuff about grand theft auto 6 in itself and we are getting all this information due to the internet being awesome and then we just get things early like that but you know i'm gonna go ahead and share a couple of things to you guys today and the first thing i want to go ahead and mention is with the brand new map now if if you guys don't know, you, you usually go ahead and spot like map concept arts out there. Now there is a bunch of them and I mean there is a bunch of them like I'm going to go ahead and share a couple of with you guys and some of them do look like complete shit like I'm not going to lie to you dudes they, they do look like complete shit and, and sometimes we get ones that look absolutely terrific like oh my god dude like it, it could literally be made just for the game itself so I happened to find one of these maps so a lot of people were going ahead and telling me Sernando Dude, this this can definitely be a GTA 6 map. I mean, look look how fucking look how fucking terrific this looks compared to the other map that we just saw, man. The other concept maps have nothing on this whatsoever and, and it just looks absolutely terrific. So basically what you guys are seeing right here is Grand Theft Auto Earth. Now supposedly this is gonna go ahead and be the brand new map for GTA 6. Now I can 100% confirm it, but I don't know dude like this shit right here looks pretty impressive so right there we have Los Santos so of course this map is basically like a Google Earth version of GTA 5 now I guess it's transported over to GTA 6 and basically everybody knows that you want you you guys pretty much want all the Grand Theft Auto worlds or cities to be to be all together. So there it is: Las Venturas, Grapeseed, San Friero, Los Santos. All of this stuff, all in one huge map. Now think about it, guys. Just just think about it. You traveling the desert, the the seas, all that type of stuff on transportation vehicles or an airplane going over towards your favorite places such as Liberty City and all that good stuff all over the world and basically this is going to be something revolutionary. Now I'm pretty sure that GTA 6 is not going to go ahead and uh, do the exact same thing that the other Grand Theft Auto games have been doing for all this time. They're going to do something revolutionary so I'm pretty sure Rockstar is going to go ahead and give us something that's absolutely you know crazy man I mean the whole idea about adding three main characters did sound kind of far-fetched but again guys the people are rockstar games that their minds are absolutely crazy man I mean I never know exactly what might pop out from 
from from their from their vaginas next but basically this huge concept map for GTA 6 was created and made by another person known as Sengen so make sure you guys check him out his link will be down below and basically right here he did create this huge GTA 6 concept map world and what I'm really hopeful right here is the fact that I don't know maybe a rockstar employee will watch this video and get some inspiration from this for they can go ahead and implement something like this in their game like look at this man like look at this humongous thing here we got Vice City Liberty City Los Santos you know all these type of places all crumped up into one huge world and you know we can go ahead and fly from you know state to state to state and have our own little adventures in Grand Theft Auto and maybe this can be like the biggest Grand Theft Auto game ever created if they go ahead and implement something like this so I don't know man this is something that I've been really hoping for and let me know down below guys what you guys think about this whole thing would you guys be interested into a Grand Theft Auto game that is as big as this or do you guys prefer the small maps that GTA already gave us before in the past but anywho moving away from all that foolishness now we're gonna go ahead and tell you guys about all the information that we know so far in regards to GTA 6 so first of all let's go ahead and talk about the location on where GTA 6 can take place at so a lot of people were actually saying that it could take place again in Liberty City just like GTA 4 now some other people said in Tokyo which in my opinion would be a pretty cool idea actually and other reports were saying that the game could take place in the whole United United States like you can go from plane to plane and travel across the states upon states from Liberty City to Los Santos to all those crazy places and in my honest opinion that would be pretty fucking awesome and other people have been saying London yeah London that's pretty fucking crazy actually now a GTA game actually taking place in London doesn't sound like a pretty bad idea in my honest opinion I mean I would love it if I can actually go ahead and visit there or if they were to go ahead and have a GTA whole world map like the US where you can fly to London and fly to other places and that in my honest opinion will make the game pretty much absolutely fucking awesome I mean having the option to travel around the states in the GTA world will be pretty awesome in my honest opinion man but anyways how about we go ahead and move on dude now if you guys don't know GTA 6 is in development I mean we got a bunch of reports already and right here I'm gonna be sharing them with you so right here it says Rockstar has allegedly started work a new iteration in the Grand Theft Auto series although the studio has yet to settle on the location for GTA 6 now right here it says this comes according to a report from Tech Raider citing an unnamed insider source that said preliminary work has begun on the sequel the source claims that the studio at one point were considering a GTA game set in Tokyo but was put off by the problematic road system and the difficulties of moving the game outside of the USA. So not only do we have reports that GTA was actually going to take place in Tokyo, which again does sound pretty fucking awesome, but it looks like it was canceled all due to the fact that a gaming company in the US and in the UK will be kind of difficult for them to understand how the things in Tokyo work. I mean, it is a totally different place than here, so I guess that will be kind of difficult for them to actually go ahead and complete. But right here it says Rockstar was a Allegedly considering a GTA Tokyo around the time of GTA Vice City, so it's likely that the developers opted for the LA aspiring San Andreas instead. The game came over a decade ago and all the iteration in the series since then has been set in the US. Could Rockstar be tempted to stray outside of North America for GTA 6? There are no firm details about the next game's location, but a US based setting is still the most likely to happen. Aside from the expansion from the original Grand Theft Auto set in London, all games in the series have been based in America. So, right here, I can pretty much tell you guys that since Rockstar hasn't really done anything outside of North America, it would be kind of weird for them to transition to that now. So, I'm more in the likely part that the game could probably take place back in Liberty City, or we can go ahead and combine Los Santos and Liberty City together where we can go ahead and fly there in and out or they can actually give us a whole map that takes place in the whole United States of America but how about we go ahead and stray away from that and talk about the release date on when GTA 6 can actually come out so right here it says GTA 6 development will be at an early stage and with GTA Online going strong 
it will likely be a couple of years before Rockstar is ready to bring out a sequel to GTA 5. There was a 4 year gap between San Andreas and GTA 4 and a 5 year gap between GTA 4 and GTA 5. Using this pattern as a rough yardstick, GTA 6 is likely to turn up around 2017 and 2018 as you guys can see from right here. So a lot of people, like I said before, have been saying the year 2018 is around the perfect date where Rockstar can, can make this game come out. I mean I've been saying this for the past videos where I talk about GTA 6 and it would make actual sense. My best guess is we're going to get some type of trailer for GTA 6 around 2017 at the earliest and then 2018 is when Rockstar will actually release this game and all of us can go ahead and kill each other over on that game which would be pretty fucking awesome in my opinion but with that being said I do hope that you guys enjoyed today's video hopefully we get some more information as the months go and roll by I mean GTA online is still going on so hopefully when Rockstar is done with all the DLC and stuff we'll go ahead and get some new games by Rockstar like Red Dead Redemption and Bully and then probably a GTA 6 around 2018 which would be pretty fucking awesome in my opinion you know opinion anyways thank you guys so much for watching today's video all the way towards the end i really do appreciate you guys and also if you did enjoy make sure you leave that blue thumbs up it'll be ever so much appreciated dude also subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand spanking new i will hit you if you missed out any of my brand new videos and with that being said i'll see you guys later and peace